The following is a selected video from yourteacher.com where you can browse over 450 complete math lessons with example videos, interactive practice problems, self-tests, and more. Try a complete lesson today at yourteacher.com. If we're asked to solve for x in the equation x plus 2 equals 6, what we're really being asked to do is get x by itself on one side of the equation. So if we take a look at the left side of our equation, a 2 is being added to x. So in order to get x by itself, we must subtract 2 from the left side of the equation. And remember from your first rule of solving equations that if we subtract 2 from the left side of the equation, we must also subtract 2 from the right side of the equation. So on the left side, our plus 2 and minus 2 cancel out, and we're left with x. On the right side of the equation, 6 minus 2 simplifies to 4. So our answer is x equals 4. The nice thing about solving equations is that you can always check your answer by plugging it back in to the original equation. So here, we're going to plug a 4 back in for x in the original equation, and we get parentheses 4 plus 2 equals 6. Since 4 plus 2 equals 6 is a true statement, our answer checks, and we know that it's right. 